You need some kind of a range. Oh, the BKBs. He wants to walk in, looking for those right clicks, but will it be enough? Good hook shot afterwards. GH gets the pushback onto both. The time lapse is not going to be there. He's there gone. The but the big Ravage connects on absolutely all of them. The roar follows up on to the Queen of Pain. Dead again. Buybacks, but there's no buybacks from Miracle. Really good bro strike afterwards, though. LTW wants to run in. He's down low. Medusa, maybe it's in trouble. The fear comes out as well. Can they bring her down? Clockwork calls. GH turns, but Jackie, he's so strong. LTW wants Yo, to but the Jackie with the Rampage. He's going to come back again from the dead. The rest of Boom there to clean up. Four gone. It and is time like to call it. Sorry, you were saying? Uh, Jackie's got BKB. Sorry, uh, Acceptor. Okay. On this draft. Whoa, the huge. Oh, this is not the right position for them. DJ in trouble. DJ is just going to die. Playhard did die for this. Arnold's trying to keep the tombstone alive. Armel Wait, holding on to his BKB. Waiting for the BKB to end. They are looking for it. And Ooh. Ganesh with a monster style. <laughs> That's bleeding the scum And Gabby. Destroyed by a quicker Jackie. Now go for Armel. Armel's not going to survive this. Armel's also dying. Jackie showing us Manta style dodges are still hot. Like this, you have the Midas. You know, you, you get all the tombstone talents when you go to 30 here. Oh, that's a big grab. Celery going down. Tried to go for some spranking away. And now DJ pops the ulti. Tries to kill them all off. Is it going to be enough? Well, Duraccio finds that kill quickly, and the Supernova starting to die. Quinn trying to get it, but they don't quite have enough. And Jackie there with the ultra kill, trying to play clean up. Quinn, nowhere left to go. Not a rampage, but a rampage in spirit. That's the way. Maybe you have to do some funky play where you smoke around and kill the supports. I'm, I'm not sure. Oh, There's my good goodness. Hook yeah, that clockwork is scary. Oh, we get Harpoon. Harpoon back in, but Kasane has to be careful. That's funny. Even if you harpoon in, you got that blade mail to work with. Makoto pops the reactive armor. Batrider coming in on a creep. Gets the lasso. Finding bam, Kasane. Bam, bam. Double damage. 23 Savage. Even in melee form. Very fearsome. Ari comes in with a blast off. Connects onto two. Not a whole lot of follow up as Briah looking for somebody. Good Gets onslaught. Gets off the BKB with the pulverize as well. Ollie gets the tombstone. The grab ally is going to keep him safe and sound for the time oh, being. He gets the thunder. thunder as well. Triple kill for Makoto. And some way, some. Oh, they do get the Terror Blade eventually, but it's going to cost them dearly. Two buybacks now. Tomato oh. trying it. Uh, he's not going to get out either. 70 seconds of no buyback uh -oh. for the Drow Ranger. He's going to move. An ultra kill Makoto. Boom. And he's not done yet. The Rampage, Rampage to follow. Why not make it oh, a double, double, my friend? Stolen by the disgusting clockwork really pushed player, in either uh, as well. So I don't think Makoto can can go for a, like you know a TP and look to end he's, the game. He's trying to play. wait. DJ, yeah, Five he's more just seconds. throwing them away. And 23 Savage, he's been caught. Didn't get off the dark pack either. But now Shadow Dance up. Oh, he's gonna be looking for the fight. BKB KPSN. active. They're gonna try and lock down a Raven. Okay, here, here comes he's Makoto. A little bit, but look at the damage now onto KP. He's being focused down. Raven doesn't feel confident fighting versus Makoto. Not with that nihilism online, but so far Fnatic haven't lost a single oh. hero. Look at the toss back. It's gonna line up two for the swap. Buckle, but the fight's still going poorly here for Fnatic. DJ's gonna buy back. That's the only one they have. But they're on to Raven. Raven who has Sunder, but no BKB. Raven who's dead. A minute and a half without him. And now they take down Armel. One by one, Makoto slaying them all as Jab's doing what he can. A mega avalanche. An effort here from DJ. That's a kill at least onto KP. But it's only the fourth now for Makoto. And almost certainly gonna be the Rampage as they chase down DJ. And they'll kill him. Makoto. With the oh, what a game fight for without Chronosphere. Quest, one creep wave down, another one pushing forward, another round of illusions. They know they kind of have to force Toss this, back. but who's going to be into tossed the doom? into the AoE Doom? Can they bail him out? Oh, Where's damage. the tombstone? They can't. The damage is too fast. Now the meta is going to be on cooldown. He comes back into the second life. They have to bail him out. They have to get in there and save their Terra Blade. Force Zap trying to get him away. He's Still got a fight. The Doom is a problem. A second one coming out. And the to Terra Blade put it to the Tombstone. Tombstone, they got to focus it, but they don't have the low Shredder. The Tombstone's going to keep him alive. Talon trying thunder. to walk away. He got oh, the he went back in. He is went it enough? Chronosphere. I think he popped out of the Doom. And a second Doom now for Jab, but he did not even need it. The damage is overwhelming from the little Shredder. Shotgun Blast at the base of Quest and they are knocking him out as another round going into Malik. He's going to die as well. Two heroes dead with no buybacks. And the right what? side of the jungle holding the high ground, so they've got the vision advantage. They thought they were Roshi, but they were wrong. Tombstone is going to be dropped on the high ground. They've already found that snap fire out of position. In the meantime, Jackie, he's going to try and go on to Hero. They oh. found the Lion. Big Ravage on the high ground, but they missed Fearless. He face shifted it off. 
That's going to mean Zenki goes down to the Snapfire. Prince, he's just going to try and run. They are just controlling and kiting him up. Eventually, he will get away with the Enrage. But Jackie, he's going to have his way with Van now. And the Snapfire kisses are coming in, but they're really doing nothing. Jackie's still full mana. Prince, he's still trying with the charges right through from Masteros. And Masteros is an Ultra. Trying for a Rampage, Jackie. He will give it away, Masteros. Oh. He'll take it himself. Rampage up for the Spirit Breaker. As now they can just go for more. A big cleanup on the way. Is another nice charge out from Masteros onto P.O.L.S. That'll be a Tinker gone. Van and Zenki trying to get their way out. A double oh, Rampage God. out for Masteros. I'll tell you, Don, you might want to call it. Very them. cautious understanding that they may have that play up their sleeve. Back into the Roshan, Young PH, he'll buy and play the betas. Now the Echo comes in, skill lay. He gets a perfect. Is it going to be enough though? Not quite. The boat flies in and they are just falling like flies. Masaros cleans up. There's a Reaper's sight. An ultra kill up for Masaros. And that's the best you could ask for. That's as good as it was going to be. Letting the two more experienced players oh, farm the map like this. Corden is going a little bit crazy. Jackie, however, he's only being stopped by the Brulings. Corden is stopped by the Primal Roar, oh, yeah. and he's going to die okay. immediately. Januel sends the tree flying. Here comes Masteros. Mortimer's kids are flying as well, and Duba will die. Masteros, though, is a little bit too tanky. Perhaps Shackles does stop the TA for a while, and Playheart should die in the process. Good tie to Playheart as Jackie is now being attacked by two heroes on top of him. He can't get away from the Ember. Masaros might be unkillable, but he also doesn't provide anything for Jackie to survive here. And he already used the Hurricane Pike, he has no BKB. He multi shot a desperate attempt to get more damage, but in comes DJ, flying in with an extra Mortimer's Kiss cookie. And Masaros, is it even worth it yeah, to chase no. him? Just let him go. Now they're just gonna kind of look at him awkwardly. Maybe. Januel wants to sacrifice himself for this. He really hates Masaros right now, but that hatred is making his team stronger. They're all going for him. Masaros, Masaros he's guys. Someone stop attacking him. He's not good. He's not a piñata. <laughs> He's a wall! Okay, well, Roar will come out, they have the Magnetize, they get off the Silence as well, and Ohio will get right click down. The Exorcism will go for Mushi, doing a decent amount of damage to that aggressive. The Boris Low comes through, he has no Infest, he has the Armlet Toggle, needs to be careful, the Spirit Type coming out, the Glimpse back onto Aggressive, gets him back in there. They get the Grave off in time though, the Open Wounds will come through, they have the Kinetic Heal, there's a Black Hole! Oh Grab the Wall Grab! On to three! Sucker as well as MMY are gonna get two down, three dead, Mushi gets a double kill, DJ are you kidding? Getting me from the low ground. So they have total map control and they're not showing. It's a beautiful smoke timing. There's Delta Scout. Mon jump in. Gonna be able to grab crit. Oh, thanks to the Spectre. Old's got a lot of damage on that Storm Spirit, but nobody was around to be able to whoa. take advantage of it. Meanwhile, Fear, whoa! Managed to get a Gen Stomp on there. DJ trying to go in. Fear's gonna be chased down by this Spectre with an Ion Shell on him. Arteezy, meanwhile, is going for the kill on Pylite Die. Nice Ice Shard separation. Now they get the slow as well. Arteezy tried to finish him with the Dark Pack, but that wasn't quite enough. Samael is here. Burst down the Storm. Fear will be able to get the Warlock eventually, but blinks away. Oh, but DJ's gonna be able to keep him up. Blink for Blink. Walrus Punch. Finish him off with a triple kill for him. Ice Shards. That's gonna miss on Arteezy. He will be able to zip that. Trying to cut him off. He's scouting them all. He might get him. Crazy initiation He's here. He's breaking all the smokes right now. They try and get the initiation, but then he, the he gets the spike air, makes the turnaround, and now, oh no, the Razor Jats gets off the BKB. Storm Stormer is taking too much damage. Turns around, what is he going to do? Not going to duel, that's the for sure. Here, they're going to be able to get the chains on out of the Razor. Jats are going to fall. They can turn out of Palace now. Pure Can he get the Bastion to be able to stay on top? Pure, he's not sure what to do here. They're going to go back in with the duel. They're going to go for the Undying. The one is done from DJ! A three man stun setting it up. The Undying falls, but Palos is still in fighting shape. They do manage to get the pullback lasso onto this Oracle, but all of Entity, they're lifting away little HP, but they still survive. And now Fjord's back in. He smells the blood in the water with the Alchemist coming back. See what they can do to him. He doesn't have a BKB, he doesn't have a way to stop all this kiting. He turns around, does manage to get a bash with another stun from DJ! What a save for the false promise though! Pure is still alive. Pure, he has to fight his way out of this one, but there's no chance in hell. The false promise is gonna wear out and he's just oh. dead. The damage does its trick. The stun, another one goes out. That's only stun. trying to run back into the tier threes, but DJ! Ever the hunter! Ever the killer! Slaying entity one by one! There's just nowhere to run. Moon getting caught at the end there. He does have a remnant up to the high ground, but Slark is going to chase after him. 23, he doesn't want to let him die. He couldn't actually burn the mana quite quick enough, so 23. Actually pulled oh, back. He still, still counts. You got him. Okay, you got him. 
he does still have oh no he ran out of mana no he barely gets the mana in but he's and they finish him off jabs with his BKB. Uh oh, he's got to get it running out. out. He got pounced again. Oh, the pounce landed. <laughs> oh, Wilson. That was the best pounce steal I have ever. Bot lanes. Huh? Good. Good for a chase onto Polison, but more heroes are rotating. NGXC. Very quick with the reactions here as they do move in again with this Orchid onto White Mon and now Kuku. He'll be vortexed up. Wukong's command being committed as well. They want the Dragon Knight and they've probably got him. Polison with a double kill on the Monkey King. And NGX, I mean, after that game one, John. We slip into Yeah. 